Hmm. Rich, creamy, and delicious. Tonkatsu Hu Ramen Pork Bone Style Ramen To make authentic tonkatsu ramen from scratch, it involves obtaining pork bones, pre-processing them, and simmering them for an extended period. Dealing with the strong odor and handling the pork bones after simmering can also be quite challenging. That's why this time, I'm introducing an easy and delicious tonkatsu-style ramen. Since it doesn't use pork, even those who can't eat pork can enjoy it. What is, Tonkatsu Fu Ramen Pork Bone Style Ramen? This is an easy and delicious soup that recreates the creamy texture of simmered pork bones using coffee creamer. While it's not authentic pork bone soup, it offers a tasty ramen option that doesn't require dealing with the smell or processing of pork bones. Please enjoy a flavor that's neither soy sauce, salt, nor miso ramen. Please put the seasoning in the ramen bowl chicken broth salt pepper soy sauce vegetable oil and coffee creamer Be careful of burns and pour 300 milliliters of hot water Stir well to dissolve Boil the noodles, drain them well, and add them to the soup. Today, I'm going to use these fresh noodles. Please separate the noodles well, put them in boiling water, stir immediately, and boil for 2 minutes. Please drain well in a colander. Please gently add the noodles to prevent the soup from splashing. Please add seaweed as a topping. Feel free to add toppings of your choice such as boiled egg, chashu, green onions, red pickled ginger, etc. Enjoy it as soon as it is done. Separate the noodles and distribute the soup evenly. It's very hot, so blow on it to cool it down. Hmm. Rich, creamy, and delicious. The seaweed soaked in the soup is delicious again.
the aroma and firmness of these Chinese noodles complement the soup. It's not as light as salt or soy sauce ramen, and it has the richness of miso ramen, but it's creamy and mild. And yet, it lacks the distinctive odor of real pork bone ramen, making it simply easy to eat and delicious. Oh, I'm running out of noodles. I want to eat more. It tastes just like the tonkatsu ramen sold in the souvenir section in Japan. It was easy and delicious. Thank you for watching. Please give it a try and enjoy.